Hi everyone, it's Karen. How are you? Happy New Year! I know I haven't been on in a little bit, but hey, I'm here now and what I'm going to talk to you about is something very important. I hope you all by now are working on this challenge from the company and that's the 45200. Do you know what that means? That means the company's given away 200 pink dollars. What are pink dollars? Pink dollars are credit. For you to use in your back office on retail items we have a new catalog coming out and wouldn't that be great to have two hundred dollars worth of pink dollars to spend on the new product i know i'm doing this challenge and i'm going to explain to you how easy it is to earn these pink dollars you just need four parties it doesn't matter when they're started and you need to hold them during the month of january so as an alternative, I know some of us, like myself, I live in Connecticut, the weather is bad in January. So sometimes you'll get a cancellation here or there. But what's a great alternative to an actual home party is what we call a party on the go. A party on the go is very easy to do, and a lot of people do them different ways. Today I'm going to show you a great way or a way that I do it uh, to get my hostesses with the product in their hand and catalogs in their hand. So first off, I have this bag here. And for those of you that went to Reunion, you probably have this. This is from Reunion a while back. This is a clear plastic bag. And I love to use these because these peak interest. Once this is full and you're walking around with this or your hostess is walking around with this, she's gonna get a lot of interest because people are gonna ask what it is. So by the end of this video, this bag is going to be filled, okay? And if you wait till the end after I post uh, this video, you're going to see a little challenge I have for all of you, okay? So you start with a bag. You can get a bag anywhere. It doesn't have to be see-through. I'm just saying it's recommended. Walmart has bags. I've seen zebra print bags. Get creative with however you want to present it. It could be a basket also if you want. I use a bag, so this is how I do it. So in your party to go bag, now I don't have um, a good space here, but I'm going to try to sit this on the table in front of me. You want to make sure that you include a catalog, okay? And on the back of all your catalogs, you want to make sure, I just pulled this one out so I don't have it marked, but you want to make sure you have your label of your name on the back of this catalog, okay? So make sure you have at least one catalog. You know, you could put more, maybe two or three, depending on how many you have but put a catalog, okay? So we have one catalog. You wanna put order forms. Again, however many you wanna put in there. I would recommend about four or five. Again, for the purposes of this, I'm just putting one in. So you're gonna put order forms, okay? A letter for your hostess. And some of you notice I just bumped this up on our team board. I have a little letter for the hostess and it explains to her what she needs to do with this bag, how to collect her orders, when uh, you expect to get the bag back, how to take care of the bag, and how long she's going to have it. Normally, I would do this for maybe one week out or two weeks out. I wouldn't go longer than two weeks with a party on the go. So include the hostess letter, and on that letter, as you can see, I have the rewards. Make sure you talk to your hostess about what she can earn, because that's going to incentivize her. If she sees something in that catalog that she wants, you can tell her she could get it absolutely free. And this will be her goal, you know, whatever range. Shoot for a $500 party. This way, uh, a single mom can get a free day of daycare. That's what I always recommend. And I explain the Heroes program. So you're going to put the hostess letter in there, okay? Now, you want to have your samplers in there. Now, I know not everybody has these. Um, hopefully, by now you have. But these are our pink scoops, and they're samplers. And what I've gone ahead and done is gotten a simple shower ring and put them together that way. Now, you can put all the samplers in there if you'd like. Uh, I, I don't know if you need to. You could put some of the most popular ones, but you want to include those in there. Okay? You can use... Um, your own little samples. A lot of people buy their own jars. This is a jar that I've bought on another site. And you can do that and put your own labels on it. Um, you can get a little drawstring bag if you'd like. These are one of those organza bags and put samplers in it. However you want to do it. Okay. So I use the shower curtain ring and I put usually 
a couple. I have an extra set of the samplers. You can buy these in our back office. They are not, they do not count towards our SV. If you want it to count towards your SV, buy containers and put product in from jars that you've actually purchased and then label them yourself. So, so far, here we go. I've got the catalog, order forms, my samplers, the hostess letter, okay? Uh, I would include one of our jewelry catalogs. And again, make sure your information is on that. And I always, always, always include an opportunity brochure. You never know when someone's interested. And it doesn't have to be your hostess. If this is in the bag, when she's showing her girlfriend or whomever, they might see it and see it and say, wow, I'm looking for some work. I need some extra money. So make sure you always include an opportunity guide. If you don't, if you can't afford an opportunity guide, you know, just make a little sheet, make a little ad, run it off so many up on a piece of paper. You don't have to get fancy, but mention something about the opportunity. So I'm putting that in there. My bag is getting full. Okay. Um, I would include, now this is all whatever your preference is. You can do whatever you'd like. I would include your Soaks Go Cards. Okay, and uh, you don't have to include all of them, you know, the whole pack. Uh, you could include just one if you'd like. I know some people that make up three or four party to go bags for the month and they have them all out during the course of the month. So they have four parties going at once. So if you did that, you can use one packet and each person gets one um, Paisley card. Purposes of this demonstration, I'm going to put them all in there okay uh, it would be nice to include a piece from our new jewelry line if you have it you can include that this is the arrowhead I didn't take it out of the um, packaging but this is our arrowhead necklace so I would include that so we have our sprinkles we have our um, soaks go cards for product items at the moment I would include a reed diffuser so I include one of the naked reeds. You don't have to include it in the box. You can keep it in the box if you want. Um, I wouldn't have it filled because you don't want to have it leakage, you know, leakage from it. So put that in there, okay? Um, also, too, you want to include some lotion. And excuse me, I don't have it. Um, I don't have it in here. Last minute, I changed where I was going to do the video. So include a Soaks lotion and a Soaks. Now, the bottle doesn't have to be all the way full, but I would, um, I would encourage you to put it in a Ziploc, too, in case it leaks. Okay? So there you have it. So you have an item from our Soaks line. Uh, you, you know, some people will put a woolly in there. Uh, wh whatever it is that you want, you know, to put in there that you think is you know, not going to break or whatever is, is portable enough for your hostess. So a woolly, a clip it, a hang it, um, those items would fit in here perfectly. Uh, some people actually put the ceramic pot in there for the hostess. Uh, you can do that, but just know, you know, it, it, there's a chance it might break or, or whatnot. So basically you could put whatever you want in your party to go bag. Okay. And then the beauty of this is you just hand it off. And you give it to your hostess and you tell her the expected date of when you want it back. And you call her, maybe as you say two weeks, call her, you know, a few days out, say, how you doing? You know, do your regular hostess coaching as you would a regular party. Check in with her, see what she's doing, see if she needs help calculating an order. Uh, and, and check in with her and let her know, um, you know, if there's any specials coming up or, or whatnot. And then when it's time to collect the bag, Give her a call, set up a meeting, and maybe at like a, a donut shop or coffee shop or whatever, and get all your orders and go over it. This is a great way to see potential uh, consultants as well. So if somebody, if your hostess does very well on doing a party on the go bag and she sells, like my first one I did, I think she sold eight fifty or something, and I was like, oh my gosh, that's crazy. And I actually uh, got uh, a consultant out of it. So. She did so well, like her friend, she worked at a hospital. Hospitals are great for uh, party on the goes, and she did awesome. So, uh, you know, 
when your hostess does well and shows that she could sell, because this is basically what you're, she's doing. You're giving this to her and she's selling it. Then, you know, you might want to ask her if she's interested and, and tell her how much you made on it and tell her that money could be hers. So that's pretty easy. That's the easy peasy way of doing the parties on the go. I hope you learned something and um, stay tuned because I'm going to show you. Hold on. <laughs> what you could win because you know I have to do a challenge right see this awesome bag I have four of them to give away people four so we're gonna do a drawing as we always do and I'm giving four bags away to the people that do the most parties so I'm gonna draw four names so I'm gonna make a post and you're gonna post how many parties you've had for the month this is for the month of January and from the top uh, four people that have the most will win. Okay, so four bags, guys. Let's get going. You're going to earn 200 pink dollars and a chance to earn this bag, this party in the go bag, and you want this. Okay, bye. Get partying.